fallout over security threats linked to this movie. It's due to hit theaters in just days. The star studded New York City premiere for the interview has now been canceled, and the theaters around the country are beefing up their security. There are plans for that. The eye opener, Jim Loke, is in Burlington this morning with what we have learned overnight. Jim. Randy, good morning. The interview is set to open at movie theaters like this one on Christmas Eve. In fact, AMC is slated to run it at its other theaters around Boston. No schedule published for this theater yet, but of course, this has been a big issue in one theater chain already. Carmike Cinemas has already yanked the movie over those security threats. This film has been at the center of that major cyber attack against Sony Pictures. The movie stars Seth Rogen and James Franco, journalists trying to kill the leader of North Korea. Theaters in Boston are again still planning to show the film when it opens on Christmas Eve. And Boston police say they're taking the threat seriously, but they're waiting to learn more before they talk about it. The warning, though, is having little effect on Bostonians. You can't let that kind of thing dictate what you do with your life. Homeland Security says there's no credible information of a threat to theaters in the U.S., but major cities like L.A. and New York are beefing up security. As for that chain that yanked the movie Carmike, they only have one location in New England. That's up in Londonderry, New Hampshire. We're live in Burlington this morning. I'm Jim Locate, WCVB, New Center 5.